Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Zips, and welcome back to Wild Frost. Hopefully today we do not struggle as badly as we did uh, last time. I am recording this instead at, instead of 4 in the morning. I am... Alright, well, it's, it's barely 4 in the afternoon. It's 3.48 in the afternoon. But, a uh, nice little 12-hour difference there. Alright. So, I remember looking at these leaders last time, and these leaders are pretty unfortunate. I think any kind of low HP barrage leader is much less useful in this clan when you could just see Gacha Pumper and have a field day. I remember, like, the... So, we've come... I came to the conclusion that these kind of, like... That these kinds of lead... Like, five-turn counter aimless leaders are particularly bad. So, I guess... It's either that or, like, the six HP guy with, like... The, like, three-turn counter three attack isn't... Terrible? It isn't the worst. What if you do this? What if you do this kind of lead leader in a Nova run? That doesn't sound all that good because you still can't really trigger that effect on final fight. Um. Okay, I'm gonna pick the three turn counter leader here, and we're gonna hope that it's gonna be okay. We are not gonna have a lot of HP to work with though. I'm gonna name you. Uh, Bram Jam. Nah. Bram Carry. Bram Carry. So, I, I would, so I've gotten to the habit of just locking Loki. I wonder if you want to click Spike here. I wonder if you want to click Binku here. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Did they buff you again? Oh yeah, they buffed your health. They needed to buff you more, buddy. So, uh... Loki's good, but Spike is also good here. With this kind of leader HP, I might just want to click Spike. And Spike is still useful offensively. And maybe it can, like, allow your leader to, like, get a kill that he otherwise wouldn't. Although Loki would probably be better for that, like, idea. See, like, if I don't get anything, I think I need, I think I've... I feel like I just always want to click Loki, because if, like, I don't... Ugh, damn it, I should have... Uh, I should have clicked Gnomes. Or I should have clicked Spike. But, yeah, you couldn't have known that you were getting penguins. Unless maybe you were psychic, which, yeah, maybe you are. Uh, what am I doing with this hand? I don't really want to, uh... I don't know, what am I doing against this Chungoon? Part of me just wants to gear him. You know what? I'll take the little bit of extra damage on. I'll take the extra two da damage because I want to start gear hammering this Chungu now. We are getting a little bit of block. So yeah, I can kill the Chungu here. Oh, uh, I have ink for that, so you're fine. I am just killing the Waddle Goon, which is lovely. Thank you, Loki. I play the junk head to get critical. That's definitely the play. And then you can snow Zuka the goblin. And we can make a little bit of money. Nice little guaranteed triple kill we can get here. Should I do a I do don't think I should. I was thinking of playing the Sun Song box to get a guaranteed to get a guaranteed critical, but I don't think it's all that worthwhile because you're just gonna end up killing the Goblin anyway. Uh, okay, you let you let Loki attacks attach attach attack first because that's 
your highest chance of getting highest chance of getting a double kill here. It's a one in three to not get one. Damn it, Loki! Come on, man. I mean, I could probably still get a double kill here, so it's fine. Yeah, because then I can just like gear hammer you, and, and we get a triple, and then we get a triple turn, a triple kill this turn. And it's still pretty good. Never sleep on Loki. Loki was doing everything correctly. Damn, Graham Carey got five block there. If what if block could last between combats? I think that'd be pretty cool. You know, I did say Nova with this kind of leader is a little interesting. Goji Burr, I would like to click here a lot, but I think you want- I think I want to try this Nova idea. Nova- and it, it is just like- it is just a good idea because it is Nova. Like, Nova can just like- does just do good things for you. I feel like I should really click this bomb bomb. But the demons are telling me to click Krago. I don't think I'm going to let the demons win today. I'm going to click Bomb Bomb. Escape in there is also pretty decent. But. It is. Picking the good option is good. I'll aim for a double kill here. I'll let Loki take. Take this damage to get a double kill. I think that's okay. You're not working with too much money because you did loot, miss out on a shop. I'm gonna play Junkhead here. See, like, we do have two hits of this. Of. Nova? Okay. I will just retrial this hand then. It's simple. I'll let Loki attack first. That's interesting. <laughs> yeah, check this out. I can just put my leader here and we get a- we kill everybody. That's pretty cool. It's scary to do, but it's gonna make for some kind of interesting early fights. It's not gonna be that useful later. But, still pretty cool. Still pretty fucking nifty, I think. Never did- this is the first time I thought of this- of this combo. Mainly because I never think of- the only time, uh, the- the gain block on kill leaders come to mind is- is when I'm complaining. We'll snow kick the porcupine. And th this fight's won, so you don't really gotta you don't really have to worry about anything. What? So I, how could we make this? Is there a way we can make this consistent? Into the late game against Frost Brigade? No. Well, okay. No. No, everything you'd be doing would take like so many resources to get out uh, to be able to get your leader to get a kill and at that point you could just put those resources into Nova so this will fall off extremely hard against final fight although so it kind of it gives us a whole run to plan for which I guess is nice Gigi's gizmo bink New Moon Biscuit. I guess I click New Moon Biscuit here. What else are you clicking? I would have clicked Bink if it wasn't consuming. Honestly, maybe I can still click. Uh, I don't know. Heals kind of rough. I would have loved to click Bink here if it wasn't consume. But Cursed Curse Charms ruin ruining fun as always i'll click new one biscuit we don't got the sauce to play gg's gizmo right now 
Jumbo Roybus Bonnie. Hello again, Mr. Roybus. How you doing? Uh, Roybus is not as good here as he once was. I think I'll still click him, though. It's okay. It's the problem is that our leader is going to soak up the buffs. When we just want them to go to Nova. Although I guess it's okay to go to. Uh, Blasty? Really good. Yeah. I'll click Blasty. Uh, I could click Clockwork Bomb or Charm. But I probably should click Neither. Maybe I can click a Frost Bloom here. So these early fights. So this combat here is going to be interesting. We're just going to try. The goal here is just to try to fish kills for Gram carry. So you can get more. More sauce for. More sauce with Nova. I need to gear hammer Snowzuka. Uh, I can't Flaska think the Porcupine to make this play viable. The HP on the Minimoko is rather unfortunate. Oh, wait, no, I've killed the Porcupine before. Okay, so I don't have to worry about the Porcupine. I might actually ink here to get critical on the Snowzuka. I think that's a good play. Wait, oh, no, it's not. <laughs> Oh man, I just lost one hit on. Oh, All yeah, right, that wasn't. That was not a good plan. I I lose one hit on Junkhead for for not much benefit. But our guy, we do have two hits of block now, so we can. If we draw, okay. Actually, I don't even think I play the snow. We if we get Blazey here, everything dies. And you know what? I think that's pretty good. I think that's pretty good. We attacked- wait, what order do I do this in, actually? I don't think there's an order you can- Uh, if I gear hammer you, you go down to- You go down to nine- okay, yeah, you do this. You do this for... Um... Yeah, okay, you can do this for another kill on Grand Carry. Bam. Bam. Then I can let... Then I can let Nova take another hit. I really should not play Roybos here, just so Junkhead can take this hit. That would be wise. AC is going crazy in the background. Thankfully, you can't hear it. At least I hope you can't. I will use Sunsong Box on Nova, I think. We shouldn't really have much issue in ending this fight from here. Nova will be attacking soon. I can do this. I would like to... I will gear hammer the... F oh, well, that was not necessary. I forgot about the one extra attack Nova had, so I kind of just wasted that. Wasted that turn. My bad. Should get Roybus in here. We can't... We cannot lose from here. This is actually... This is a pretty neat... This, er, again, early on, the setup is pretty neat. I am... This is, so, the nightmare here is if we run into, uh, as for any kind of Nova run, the nightmare is if you run into, uh, ink, ink combat. <laughs> because Nova's a lot worse without her text. Bomb bomb can soak up the blood bell nicely. I feel like I haven't played, now thinking about it, oh my god, the snowball charm, imagine the fucking bank in this setup. Man. Snowball Charm is still good here. And I think I will play it. 
I'm pretty happy with that. And I'll roll another. We'll roll another charm. King Moko is really threatening. I should put Loki back in the squad for this. What am I doing with that so far? Not sure. God! Oh, man! I'm back to the bank angle! Man, I could have gotten, like, three snowed. Made something like six snow to everybody at the start of a fight. Man, that would have been cool. Can I cook this forging stove here? I probably can. And I think I will. Although, it, it's, it is a lot of crap. Eh, maybe it's not right. Hey, look, it's old Foggy Brew. It's Foggy Brew before they buffed it. That's a good joke. I will take Roybus off the squad, and we will replace it with Luki. I will apply, give the Snowball Charm to Miss Nova. I probably am going to put a Curse Crown on this Blaze T. I think you're good. I will save the other crown for later. The other Curse Crown. Uh, this initial setup is annoying. Although I just need to, I just need to, sn I just need to ink the grumps. Wait, God, how do I kill anything here though? How does Graham Carey ever get okay? Well, it's time for this. It's time for Graham Carey to stop feeling good. Oh my God, and the grumps has fucking I. Ugh. That's really annoying. And I need this hand. I will flask of ink the grumps now, but I don't think it's really that good. I just feel like I need to get out of that hand. So I can, I could Sun Song box for a decent result here, and the, then the Grump, the Grump. So you definitely want a Sun Song box here, so you're killing the Makokos. You're snowing, snowing both. Okay, yeah, you go for this play. That's good. I definitely should try to get Bomb Bomb out here. God, man, this Grumps is just such a bastard. I hate him. Well, you know what? That is good. Getting a block on Graham Carry is good there. That is actually really good. The Grogs are likely just gonna die very soon. Although this grog is bad to hit, is bad to go off. It's bad to go down tonight. Although then I can just use the grog's own effect to my advantage. To make Graham... And then I'm able to just clear the board by gear hammering Graham... By gear hammering Graham carry. Which, you know what? I think that's pretty good. Yeah. That's pretty good. With Loki here, we never have to uh, fear King Moko. That's another thing I like a lot about Loki. Loki is make slotting Loki on your squad makes it hard to makes it pretty hard to die to King Moko, who is one of the scarier bosses in this fight or in, in this game. But the demon eyes makes cleaving through King Moko a lot easier. Another reason why Loki is the best. Oh, fucking blessed. We are not fighting the nightmare. Uh, ICGM is an excellent pickup here because we are we got this forging stove. For show. Sure. For show, sure, baby. For sure. Absolutely. 
Part of me kind of wants to click Haze Blazer here. It's cute. I don't get to play Haze Blazer much. It's fine. I think I'll play it over Bomb Bomb. Uh, Loki is probably better than Roybus. The damn. The damage he provides is gonna make, especially into this combat, if you can get a demonize off on the Wooly Drek, it's really good. Which is, granted, hard. It's not un... It's not... I should take my chances here. If you hit your leader, it's also really good, because you can just kill the Bigfoot. That's good. Definitely, we definitely are fine with that. Because then the Bigfoot just dies. We will be demonizing somebody. Unfortunately, I don't got much to do in the rest of this hand. And the Wooly Drek... Oh, I can't gank the Wooly Drek if I want to. And it might be in my best interest. Lucky will go down to one, but it's fine. And then I can, we can start, we can hit them with this initial hit and then everything, yeah, everything on the board die, will be dying. Get Junkhead out here and then I can, Gram, and then I can Gear Hammer Gram Carry for another, for, for another round on... For another round on Nova. Uh, actually, I'm gonna recall Loki here because if I can get another hit of block on Gram Carry, it's really good. I, block is really nice. Block is going super well in this run. The Paw Paw is dangerous. I should probably try to redraw for to deal with it. Yeah. Okay. We will let this block go away so Nova can get off another attack. It stops everything on the board. Haze Blazer is able to get a bl is able to bl blast the big loo here, which is really nice. I God. You know, this leader is a lot better with 13 attack. <laughs> um, <laughs> I am noticing. Which, I notice, isn't really saying much. Right. This leader is really good with 16 attack. Which, if you notice, it really isn't saying much. Alright, we sh will, we cannot lose here. Yeah, it is basically impossible. We got very lucky in fighting Big Lou. Nova destroys this fight. Really, well, a good Nova build destroys this fight. If you have like a terrible Nova setup, then I guess it would be bad. But terrible Nova sets are setups are kind of hard to come by. I have noticed. Second Snowcake is good. Second Blaze Tea is also really good. If I could get Nova to attack one more time to get the trigger one more time this run, I probably should take another Blaze to you. Although Arrival is good. I'll take the top path. I'll take a second Blaze to you. More investment. You don't need the, uh... You don't need the Proto Stomper there, because you already got ICGM. Let's take a second, Blaze, to you. Take a Crown. Take a Lumen. And then I can roll two charms here. Uh, Balance Charm, Jimbo Charm. Oh, yeah, that does it too. That will do, yeah. I think we got this. Sun Charm, you can throw that on your leader and it's fine. Our leader can 
can have that just fine. I did I get a yeah, okay, I did put the right charm on my leader. Did I get a thing for my phone? I did not. Here you go, Nova. Nice little, nice little clean Nova setup. Then we get the huge ICG and play. Extremely good. Extremely, extremely good. Look at this, this, okay, the Shrudels is a Tiny bit scary. Not that scary because right, we will just be kind of murdering everything in sight. But the question is, can can Graham Carey get a kill here? Probably not. <laughs> oh, but what if I could? But what if I could? I could gear hammer. Okay. You can do junk. This is this is completely incorrect. What I'm about to do. But if you just sacrifice Junkhead here, I am disrespecting this fight so hard by doing this. This is not at all what you're supposed to do. What I'm doing right now is completely incorrect. You should save Woodhead there. The one block is not worth it. 100% you just save Nova there. Do not, do not be silly, silly, except for this situation where you can be silly because Nova will just kill everything. And I think the, the puffball is just going to make this an even bigger bloodbath. <laughs> See here, I think if I lose your block, Nova, well, okay, it doesn't do this. Yeah, because then Nova is... Wait, what? Nova doesn't go again? Huh. I really thought she would be going again. I'll call in the rest of the enemies just because they're going to die. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. $156. Yeah. 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 Uh, not much you're doing with any of this. Guess you just take a Sun Bell, the Bell. Anything nice you can consume here? I guess not consuming a Blaze Tea is okay. Eh. It's fine. I could also just try to look for a high roll with this cake charm. Although I already have, like, frenzy charm for that kind of setup. I'll take breakfast charm. Second blaze tea might mean something. I'll take a charm merchant. Uh, smack back charm's pretty good. Does just make things kind of trivial. And I think I will take it. We get smacked once on the final fight, and then Nova will be triggering four times. Or wait, no. If I'm using both Blaze Tees, uh, that will be six times, which, you know, is, is pretty close to just ending the fight. Uh, just one more subsequent... Just one more subsequent gear hammer, and then you win final fight. So the rest of this run is... Is pretty solved, I would say. Blaze T, ICGM, bada bing. I'll blaze T again just for the hell of it. You. But can I get a kill with Graham Carey? <laughs> oh, I can get a kill with Graham Carey. Nice. Check that out. And you know what? I will loom in Graham Carey. Definitely. Now that's how it's that's how it's done. I am going to try redrawing for my uh non-consumed cave. For my Yeah, okay, I do still have a Blaze T in the deck. Uh okay. 
Okay, well, this play is a little scary and not necessary and on honestly worse because you could get a... Yeah, you should just... Uh, because I can set up for a grand carry to get a kill here. Well, yeah, kind of. Can this is by far the most like this is by far the most value I've gotten out of uh, one of these on kill. The uh, out of one of these, you know, what? on kill leaders. Yeah, I think I'll just take my screenshot of the leader here. Id on two block with Nova. Pretty cool. Uh, wave ye. Behold, as this wave, uh, disappears. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's pretty good. We'll get Loki out here just to make the, the kill on... To just make the kill on Mr. Numskull a little bit quicker. Although I can just gunk for kill here and it doesn't matter. <laughs> Nothing matters when you got a Nova this, this beefy. Be annoying here if I missed out on a crown. It is pretty annoying. It's sad. It's sad because I don't get my other Blaze team to play. I'm going to take the charm because I would like to roll one more item to see if I can get anything with this. I probably saw an item earlier that I could have used the uh that I could have used the uh see like it's not even like I need to give Blaze T like I need to give this to this Blaze T because the other this Blaze T won't consume on the first play. Uh Blaze Bomb Can you set up a turn one How does this work actually? How does this work with the, um... How does this blaze bomb work with the, uh... With... So let's think, let's think about this. If you frenzy try and blaze bomb, it will hit Nova once. Then it will trigger a block on the second. It will trigger a block on the next two hits. So that would be a one frenzy hit and then a two frenzy hit. Nah, I don't think that's good. I, it, it's better value. You know what? I'm just just gonna do this because I think it looks funny. Look at this demon heart. <laughs> no, nothing like this has ever been seen before. Unless you, well, okay, it's something like. You know, I feel like I'm always playing. I feel like, God, I feel like I this spike wall is like pranking me in case I had like spark charm on Nova here. Oh wait, no, that wouldn't even work because I have a snow snowball charm on on Manova. So uh get wrecked. I should redraw for my blaze bomb here. Don't let your leader hit into the spike wall. Uh I should ink here. Need to ink Frost Guardian. And then you will be, and then you can gear hammer here safely. Yeah. We'll let Haze Bla we'll let uh Haze Blazer take this hit. Oh, wait, I should have put Bomb Bob on the squad. That was my mistake. Because my leader can get hit by the... Oh, wait, no, he can't. No, he can't. I... No, never mind. It's fine. I was thinking my leader had 8... Had 8 HP at baseline, but that's not true. That is simply false. So, I feel like I hear... I should try to aim for kills on... On your boy Graham. Yeah, I think that's death. I think that it is optimal to do. Another block would help 
Oh, I... I'm sorry there, Miss... I'm, I am sorry there, Haze Blazer. I am... See, like, this is the kind of run where I... I'm, like, just gonna get punished soon. I am, like, just purposely kind of playing Laze. Uh, I am actually in a bit of game. I should blaze T here. It's kind it's gonna be annoying when this, um, when the Uber Bear shows up. So the Uber Bear stops me in my tracks. I could have killed on this turn. Turn, I think, because I was still. Yeah, but then the Uba Bear locks you out. Because Uba Bear's a damn bastard. Get Demon Heart, idiot. It's fine. Because then I just break block this turn and then you get the kill. So. Was there really any fear? I don't think so. Cage Blizzard gets halved. Take HP. I don't got no charms, so I would like Sunbelt Charge. And I think the setup here is pretty easy for a dub. I will replace Haze Blazer and also take Loki out of the squad. But I will put Bomb Bomb in. Because I might need somebody to take some damage. Okay. Off we go. Off we go, off we blow. I... I don't know if I- I don't think I've ever seen a, this setup on Frost Jailer. He got both- Let's see here, uh... Iceborne Bell, which- Uh, which bell am I? Frost- some enemies in Frostlands will have the Sun Charm, so Frost Jailer got both the Sun Charm and the, uh... And the, uh, which is the other bell? The Frost Hand. Got hit by the Frost Hand bell. Interesting. Curious. Alright. I should just redraw here. Okay. I guess my Blaze T wants to be at the bottom of my deck. I don't need to worry about freezing this Frost Crusher. In fact, I. Yeah, I don't need to worry. You want the smack back to go through. Cause it just Yeah, no, we won. <laughs> oh my it's so close to a turn one. If I had another crown here, I might have been able if I had another crown here in a smaller deck, I think I could have killed there. Let me take a screenshot of this Nova. Nice little nice little easy Nova build. But it was this run was nice because we were able to explore new possibility with Nova with the gain block on kill leaders. This made like the the mid game especially like especially easy because you were able to just like you were able to very e you were easily able to fuel the nova very good that was yeah that was a that was a little bit of a that was a little bit of a nova stop new nova possibilities that'd be a good name that'd be it okay name for this video maybe not the most accurate because it, like, maybe that's like dramatizing it a little bit because like no nova possibilities like discovering some crazy new tech i was like oh wait yeah you can just like use this like usually like bad kind of leader to make nova better and is the uh, nova a bit better we are on a nice 10 win streak what is the win rate looking on this file nice little fucking 70 percent we are... This is gonna get even higher, man. Uh, this leader is really good, and we'll probably be playing it next time. Anyway, that's good for this episode of Wild Frost. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to like, comment, and or subscribe. And all of you out there, have a nice day.